Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I filmed this look right here. Let's just jump right in because it's gonna get weird. So unfortunately the only thing that I don't have that drugstore is primer. If you're curious, it's the Makeup Forever Hydrating Primer. So everyone's always asking me what's my favorite drugstore or affordable foundation and that is always the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation. This color is probably going to 100% be off, but we'll, we'll fix it. If we're going to be honest, I haven't used this in obviously a long time because that is butt white. That is not my shade, girl. I've been in the sun pretty often lately, so I'm really tan. This is really tan for me right now, except this foundation's not very tan. It's not horrible, but it's definitely not my shade. Um, <laughs> but I do love this foundation. It's okay. Well, bronze. A little more so this foundation does look really good in picture I would say it's like matte satin I think it would be really good for all skin types um, I personally wouldn't be nervous at all to put it on oily skin So I definitely have a favorite concealer at the drugstore and that is the LA Girl Pro Conceal. <gasps> These are just really great to have in your kit as a makeup artist. Um, they photograph well, they look awesome. <laughs> I have an addiction to makeup. Yellow really works to brighten up this area. Yes, I'm ready. And I'm going to push this all over the place. Mostly staying in the hollow, but because my foundation is super light. have a or at least I couldn't find a drugstore powder but I am going to use an affordable one and that is the RCMA translucent powder okay I'm actually going to put quite a bit right underneath my eyes just to catch any fallout because I'm going to go in with eyeshadow next. I need a little bit more. need a little more fam. <laughs> this stuff, it like snows everywhere. I hate this packaging. So I picked this up from the local CVS and it is the Ilux Mesmerizing Palette. And it looks like this. <gasps> I'm feeling it. So I'm first gonna go in with this bottom shade right here, which is like a mauve kind. Of, it's kind of the color of my shirt. <laughs> and I'm kind of just gonna put this in the crease, but kind of just messily everywhere. Um, I really don't have a plan on what I'm doing. 
per usual. I am so excited for fall. I say this every single year. I am so ready to watch Hocus Pocus and pumpkins and sweaters. blend up here this is a really easy eye look anyone can do this I promise I'm just gonna go in with this darker shade right here and I'm just gonna keep that in the outer corner of my eye I'm going to go in with the lighter shade of the palette, that really pretty white, creamy color. Touch on my inner corners. And a little bit of my brow bone. Waterproof Le Chick Flick. Mascara by NYX. I used to use the Maybelline mascaras and I like the one in the hot pink tube. Oh my man. That's okay. It'll be fine. You're doing great, sweetie. I'm gonna pop these on and these are the Ardell Wispies. So I'm gonna go over that with a little bit of liquid liner and I'm using the Flower Beauty liquid liner. <laughs> Jumping right into bronzer, we're gonna go in with the Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer. I'm gonna go in with this very old, um, the labels rubbed off on it, but this is the Milani Baked Bronzer in the shade Glow. Toasted Cinnamon. It's my fed. And I've actually been using it on a, that's not the brush I use. So I've actually been using it on a Luxie brush, the Duo Fiber Powder. But I just picked this one up by accident and you could probably use this one too. And this is the M427. I'm actually gonna top it with a little bit of Bare Peach. Is it Bare Peach? But yes, Bare Peach. Another one by Burt's Bees. Get off. I have a few favorite highlighters from the drugstore, actually. One of my favorites is the Wet n Wild Precious Petals. That's one of my faves. I also like the Golden Flower Crown. I have that one sitting right here as well. Actually, this one might look a little bit better. We're going to mix some. So I typically don't put mascara on my bottom lashes. I just don't like the way that it looks on me. But if that's your jam, girl, do your thing. By lining my lips with the Suede Matte Lip Liner in the shade Linden. And next I'm gonna go in with the Milani Amore Shine Liquid Lip in Tenderness. And I really like this applicator. Wow, I really like this applicator. So it's a point, but it also has a little bit of a cup. The tip is really nice to get in. I have a brush hair in my nose. The tip is really nice to get the edges of your lip though. I appreciate that. Ooh, I really like that. 
So go ahead and spray your face. I don't, I thought I had a drugstore spray because I really like quite a few of them and I couldn't find one. So go ahead and set your face. Ooh. So yeah, I really like this look. I love how it turned out. I love my eye color. I love the browns. I really like this lip color. Yeah, so if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Catch you guys next time. Bye.